Hey guys, welcome back to another video on Sword Art Online. Some of you have asked me how to play this game because, you know, it's mostly in Japanese, but um, I thought it was pretty easy to get used to, but maybe that's just me. But anyways, let's go over some of the stuff. This is Upgrade. Upgrade is essentially where you upgrade your weapon and things like that. And, you know, it does cost these things called COL. I'm not sure what COL is, but it looks like a money bag kind of thing. And then after that, it's going to cost... Uh, gems or not gems I don't know these jewel kind of things right and you know it's different across every weapon the second one I think is just regular weapon upgrade um, if you have other items that fuse it into the weapon and of course the last one is sell now I don't want to go over too much of it on it because it you know it's not too important for this section but let's go over some of the stuff the more important thing is the mission obviously some that's something that's really good you get premium currency uh, which is great, of course. And scout is where you summon stuff. So, you know, if you want new characters, that's where you're going to need to go. To scout for new characters. Alright. And, you know, we did a multi-summon. I don't know. I didn't get what I wanted. And I stopped creating accounts. I feel like, you know, it's hard. And then I, I don't have access to multi yet. I'm not sure. Multiplayer. I'm not sure if it's activated. But quest... Party and town. So town is essentially, you know, just the place you're at. And instead of dragging, I mean, instead of just tapping, you can just, like, tap. You can actually go into a place like that. It's the same stuff. But let's go into party if you're wondering what about party. Party is just where your characters are. This bottom button is where you can change characters. You'll have to tap on the character you want to remove and then tap on the character you want to put into the party. Now like that. There we go. And then we go back. I want to bring that character back. This one is to use the experience bottles that you pick up. And you do get those experience bottles. And you, you know, you just do this. And there we go. I don't think it costs anything, but... You know, your experience bottles are gone. You have these. I figured out that these crystals are actually used to upgrade things. If you're wondering, these crystals, they're used to activate your abilities. Or, I guess, break the limit. My bad. Break the limit. And you need 50 of them, which is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Let's go over here. This is, I don't know, just basically your card list. That's what it is, guys. Your card list. And let me go back out of here. This one, if you're wondering what the button on all these three things is, this one is basically where you can equip your equipment. Alright, let's go back. And this one is essentially, you know, the where you upgrade your characters. And I already did it. This is where the break limit I was talking about. You could attack break limit, but you need 50 of these crystals here. That's what I was talking about earlier. Now, let me try to open this. And you, need, you do need keys to open these uh, level 30. There's level 10, level 20, and then here we go with level 30. And essentially... I don't know what they're saying. But yeah, I mean, <laughs> I wish I knew what they're saying, but I don't. Anyways, once you break the limit, you can go in here and start upgrading your characters and increasing the damage that it can do. There you go. You notice the increase. This one. And they do cost these special kind of thing. These special, I don't know, gem that I was calling it. And this one costs the green one. There we go. You notice the increase. This one's MP. There we go. And we don't have enough. So, you know, we can't do anything. Which kind of stinks. But that's the bulk of the characters and things like that. Let me go back out of here. I guess we might as well go into a battle as well. And go over those menus. Let's go back out of here. Okay, so quest is the most important thing. And, you know, this is where you get to upgrade your characters and stuff like that. There's two different things. There's... Hard and there's normal. And hard is obviously harder, right? Normal obviously is normal. And, you know, if you get three of these trophies, you'll get a total of five 
premium currency per stage. And info, yada yada. I'm not sure what you're supposed to do with the thing, but let me go on in here. Now, we have a friend here which, you know, we can actually play with, which is good. And of course, if you want to boost your EXP and money, you could press the boost at the bottom. And then you just start, right? That's basically what I've been doing. I haven't done anything that's too special, but hey, you know, we got some good stuff. Hopefully you guys do and will as well. Let's go back over here. All right, they're having a conversation. And these guys are actually very hard for me to battle. They have these resistant thing. Oh man, he guard broke me. All right. Yeah, that, those guys are really, really hard, guys. Yeah, those guys are really hard. Usually, I have to use my special to beat them. And, you know, basically, you, you could swipe back to dodge back, swipe up to jump. But I don't use those that much. And, of course, I just go all out with brute force, man. And you can hit them from behind, then their shield won't work. But these are just the monsters I'm fighting. You might have different monsters compared to me. Alright, this guy is really hard. Large elemental. This one I think requires some sort of uh mage. Oh, actually, this guy has weakness to this guy. This guy's a heavy hitter, isn't he? But he's only level 11. Which kind of stinks. But each monster has their own weakness. Alright, we got a level 40 key. Which is pretty good. Of course, there's the mysterious guy. Oh, right. I remember this. Oh, he's a killer. And weren't they friends or something? I, I don't remember exactly. It's been a while since I watched the anime. All right. See, notice to clear. We got five premium currency here. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. We got a 40 level key, which we, you know, once we get to level 40, I'm almost at level 40. I didn't know that. All right. Once I get to level 40, I should be able to unlock it. And the chest, I got to say that, you know, I think the last one's going to have the skinny bottle. No. All right. You, the chests are kind of mixed up sometimes. Not exactly. I mean, sometimes I feel like, hey, it, it it's rigged to the same portion, but... Up next, we have a story. I might as well go over it with you guys as well. But that's essentially how you play. And I've gone over most of the things that, you know, the basic necessities. Now, if you want to do some heavy duty stuff, I'm not sure what I need to do. But I'll let you know in the next video if I do do it. But I do like this game. It's just that I'm, I didn't get the character I want. And I did a multi-summon. Oh, yeah. There's that crazy guy. So, you know, it follows the story very well. Wasn't he the husband or something? Or maybe that's another... Whatever. Alright, we got a premium currency. And you only get one. That's the thing. I mean... I don't know. Okay, we got a total of 20 now. I did, I guess we need five more before we could do anything. So we got a trophy cup. I'm not sure what those things are for. But let's get back out of here. Hey. 
All right, that probably unlocks the the uh, next chapter. There we go. So that would be chapter seven, and then you know once we get to chapter thirteen, that's the or fourteen or quest chapter fourteen. Of course, there's this section. It's I don't know what those are. I think they're different things. They're different um, Sao. Yeah, I think that the this one is like I don't know. This one looks like the fairy one, and this one is probably something else. Probably the gun one. There was a there was one with the gun, right? It's in the, called another game though. I'm kind of disappointed because I didn't, you know, I didn't get the, any of the four star character I wanted. I mean, I gotten some character three star. They're good and all, but I wanted a four star. Oh well, I can't do anything. But let me go on in here. I want to show you guys something. There is something on this quest. I think it's this one. There is something here. And I keep missing it. I don't like it because I keep missing it. Or I, I keep missing it because I picked the wrong chest. They gi they given out like some sort of uh, armoring. There's a the cloak and then there's this other thing. Let me just skip over. <laughs> All right, let's go. So I'll show you guys quickly if I can actually get this. You notice that there's, there's a circle there. I keep on tapping. I'm hoping that... We're level 39, man. I don't know what level you are. Vertical square. All right. I'm gonna show you guys after, or I guess when I'm done this. Gonna fight the wolf. You'd think I'd be late, being level 39 would benefit me much more. Dude! Alright, I'm gonna have to kill you. All right, the mantis is dead. He has weakness to me, right? To my character, especially my four-star character. All right, we're done. But you know, you can block and stuff like that. You hold the button to block. Okay, we got some, you know, uh, HP stuff, some other things. Not too crazy about it. I am e trying to level up the, this character. Okay, this is the, this is where it is, but, oh man. Usually there's a cloak here, but there isn't one today. Yeah, what luck. Anyways, that is about it for this video. That's how you play uh, the game. If you're wondering, I don't think there's anything that I, else I need to go over. If it, there is, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, let me go back here. I want to show you guys. I completed almost every one of these to to 100%. You know, all the trophies. And I had to get to chapter 6 to actually be able to get 250 for one multi-summon. And believe